Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try this Hawaiian style chicken. This one is grilled boneless skinless chicken thigh meat and teriyaki sauce with, sauce with pineapple. If I can speak today. Um, it's Park Street Deli, which is an Aldi brand. So we bought this at Aldi. It was $5.99. There's really, I think there's like three servings in here. Um, so it's 16 ounces or one pounds or 454 grams. It looks really good from the picture. Let's see, calories. Uh, five ounces, about three servings. That's what I thought. 180 calories per serving. And there's your other information if you'd like. So we can do this a um, couple different ways. Microwave is recommended, but you can also boil and bag uh, from the stovetop. And this is refrigerated in the refrigerated section, but you can freeze it if you'd like to do that as well. So in the microwave, we're going to remove the outer sleeve from the tray, uh, pierce or leave the inner pouch in the tray, puncture the inner pouch, place it in the microwave. Heat on high for three minutes or until hot. Cooking times may vary. Um, open pouch and empty product into serving dish. So that's what it looks like. It's very, very dark. I guess that's the um, teriyaki sauce. So I'm going to, um, let's see, let's find a good place to vent this. I'm just going to cut a slot, right? Right there. That'll vent it to keep it from exploding. And then get it in the microwave and I'll be back when it comes out. Okay, so here it is out of the microwave, and there's not much to look at, but let me see if I can get this out without spilling it everywhere. I generally, yeah, just cut the top open. But you gotta be careful, don't let go of it uh, too early, it'll dump stuff everywhere. It's going here, there we go. Yeah. It smells really good. It almost smells like a, almost like a Salisbury steak um, smell. So this is what it looks like. Um, it looks like you get one good size thigh is what I got. And then I got another thigh that's basically just in pieces. So basically you get two, you get two thighs and plenty of these little pineapple pieces in here as well. So I'm going to let this cool off. First of all, it's got some really good uh, amount of sauce in there too. So yeah, I'm going to let this cool off and I'll be back. I gave it uh, just a minute or two to cool off. I cut one piece into pieces just so I could eat it easier on video. Um, it has a very strong soy sauce kind of flavor to it. I mean, a uh, smell to it. Um, so I'm expecting a lot of soy sauce, which I like soy sauce. Um, so I got a piece of pineapple on here and a piece of chicken. I'll tell you what, the chicken is super tender. A good moisture uh, content in there. It's not dry at all. Um, it's not tough. Um, has a good flavor. It's it's just really good chicken. Um, I like chicken thighs anyway. I think chicken thighs are probably one of the my favorite um, cuts of chicken, honestly. The pineapple adds a little sweetness to it, which I like. It also has a little, um, a slight variety in texture, um, the pineapple does. I really like this meal, it's very, very good. It's, um, it's got a really good balance of flavors. The textures are excellent. Um, I like how the pineapple and the chicken go together. It does have a really good soy sauce flavor. And uh, the pineapple, like I said, just adds a sweetness to it. So I really like this. Um, I guess the Hawaiian style is just the, uh, is the pineapple in there, but it is a, a soy teriyaki um, flavor. If you like teriyaki, I keep saying soy, but it's really teriyaki. Um, as it doesn't have that vinegary flavor kind of the soy sauce does, but if you like that, um, not vinegar, but um, sesame seedy kind of flavor. If you if you like that kind of flavor, this is similar to that. Um, the teriyaki is very good. It's very sweet, um, but it's also got a little spice to it. I wish I had a little bit more like heat spice to it, like a little bit more not pepper necessarily, but I don't know, just a little more of a, of a spice spice, like a pepper or something like that. Um, it would be better, but I like it just the way it is. I'm going to give this one a five out of five. I really enjoy this texture, flavors. Everything's well balanced. Um, yeah, you can't, can't beat it. And it's got, the chicken even has this like, uh, like this grilled smoky texture to it. Like you really did grill it on a grill. Um, I like that. And it has the little black stripes on it, just like it was done a grill, which it may have been. So, uh, so yeah, I'm gonna give this one a five out of five. Definitely, if you see this in an Aldi, don't be afraid to try it because it is really, really good. And if you don't wanna eat the whole thing at lunch, if you don't wanna eat that many calories, um, 
just eat half of it and save the other half, uh, wrap it up and um, put it in a bowl or some kind, just take a bowl with you, uh, put it in a bowl and heat it up the next day. So I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.